pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Good morning Mustangs. Mustangs. I'm Tyler and I'm here with Ethan. Today is December 13th, 29th. Try this act of kindness. Be honest even, you are, even if you are shy or worried about what others think. It is important to be honest with yourself and people around you. The canned food drive has started. Donate as many cans of food as you can. The food goes to help the students and families of Will Rogers. The first period class with the most donations will win a root beer float party. We only have enough dry goods for about five families right now. We expect to deliver about to about 30 families. Please bring in non-dented, non-expired dry goods and canned foods. Here are the points to order for the food items. 25 points each. Canned dried foods, corns, beans, peas, yams, gravy, soup, cranberry sauce, tomato, fruit, mashed potatoes, stuffing, mac and cheese, rice, cereal, ETC. 10 points each small items. Top Robin, is that type soup, jello, pudding, small cans, baby food, etc. 50 points a bag, 10 pounds potatoes or rice, bring next week only. Let's find out more about the seventh grade dance that is today during sixth period. Hi, my friends. I'm Flew, the leader of the seventh grade dance, and today I will be telling you about the seventh grade dance. It is today, Friday, December 13th, and it is during sixth period. There is the option of going to Mrs. Reed's room, to Mrs. Reed's computer room, or going to the MP room. Wherever you go, you must stay there the whole time. Those of you on the inclusion list will check in with your sixth period teachers and then be released to go to the dance. Those of you on the exclusion list will just go to your sixth period class as if it's a normal day. The okay. The criteria of whether or not you can go to the seventh grade dance is that you have to have no use on your effort grade, no suspensions, a 2.5 or higher effort grade, and you have to have four or less major referrals. Miss, Mr. Spence, Ms. Chapman, Mr. Thomas, and Mrs. Kyoto are all the teachers being recognized in December. If you see them in the hallway, give them a high five and tell them what a great job they are doing. Let's see what people love about Miss Kyoto. I like Miss Kyoto because she's great at teaching. Hey, I'm Ethan, and Miss Kyoto's a good teacher. Bye. I don't have Miss Kyoto, but I've heard she's really nice, and she's just a really smart teacher. About Miss Kyoto is one I had her last two years, and I. And second, I was talking about the past. And third off, if I had my whole piece of my ex consideration for one reason is I'm talking about the past for the last. Um, I, hi, I think Miss Kyoto is a good teacher. Hi, my name is Derek, and Miss Kyoto is a good teacher because she helped me with all my work. Hi guys, my name's Thomas the Choo Choo Train, and Miss Kyoto is very nice, and she's very smart, and I never had her before, but I just know this. Bye. She is so nice. She's so beautiful. <laughs> she makes good food. I love her. I'm Akiro, and I appreciate Miss Kyoto's creative ideas in photography club. My name is Robert. Uh, Miss <laughs> Miss Kato, she's like, I see her in the hallways all the time, and she seems like a really good teacher. Kato is one of the best teachers. She's a nice teacher, and she's good. Miss Kato is a nice English teacher. If she wasn't there for my seventh grade year, I wouldn't be here now. Miss Kato, we really appreciate you here. Will Rogers, you've really been so welcoming to me since I started here, and I know you're such a great teacher. The kids love you. Is a nice teacher and she helps me with my work. The first shout out goes to Julian, grade six, referred by Miss Westlake for being ready. Julian was ready and participating in class assignments with great effort. Thank you so much. Teachers, we need more shout outs. Time for the, the shout, shout out drawing. drawing. If you are picked, you get a free drink from the Starbucks Hall, Madison and Dewey. Denise Trift.
Congratulations. It will be get delivered to you in your first period class. Our Peace Days booster has started. It is aimed at increasing the peace and reducing conflicts and fights on campus. The school will accumulate peace days, which are defined as days with no physical altercations, including before and after school. There will be a whole school rewards for reaching milestones of five days, 10 days, and 15 days in a row. Don't forget Pride Pack meets in Mr. Gaither's <laughs> office by room five during both lunches. Get your classes in the hallway near the office. Let's take a sneak peek into what happens in the sun and also a star. <laughs> People spend their whole lives looking for love. Poems and songs and entire novels are written about it, but how can you trust something that can end as suddenly as it begins? That's it today for the Mustang Morning News. I'm Tyler. I'm Ethan. Signing off.